On Monday, the market capitalization, which opened at 12.2 trillion naira, lost about 195 billion naira to close at 12.004 trillion naira. The All Share Index depreciated by 1.6% to 32,190 from 32,715 at which it opened the market. On Tuesday, the equities market continued on a downward projection with the All Share Index depreciating by 1.61% to close at 32,406.17 basis points. It is believed the postponement was the major reason investors cashed out. And the outlook of the economy was dampened by that postponement because it increased the political risk associated with the country. So what has happened is that investors have to price in the possibility that the elections will not hold successfully or that the election outcome may not be accepted by the parties. So, and that was why people were excelling, exiting their variable assets so as to hold their instruments or their funds in very liquid format. An economist said market activities had little or nothing to do with the postponement of the election. I wouldn't say the postponement has had any real effect on the on the capital markets itself, largely because investors, foreign and institutional, have already been on the fence, waiting largely for the outcome of the election, rather than for any, um, would you say, any issues around the election itself um, before actually investing. This experts say the downward trend will continue to trade the financial services sector, but will stabilize as election progresses. The hope that whoever emerges winner would put in place financial friendly policies that would boost investor confidence in the capital market. Mercy Frank, STV News.